Hello, welcome to TCI 537, and I'm broadcasting from Snoqualmie, up in the mountains here, and I'm going to try to make this class really interesting. Uh, since it's an online course, we may not have direct correspondence uh, via other than anything other than email, uh, but we might do some Skype stuff. So we'll see. Uh, my name is Scott LaDuke. I'll be the instructor for the class, and we are going to be bridging technology gaps in the online version of this course. So what we're going to explore is what can we do to bridge the gaps in technology? Schools and school districts that have material and those who do not, what are some strategies we can employ? What are some things that are going on that we can investigate and attempt to put in place? So we're going to explore that. I'm going to be using social media for this class. It works for Facebook. Why not try it for ourselves to build community? The idea is for this class what we want to do is leverage all the great stuff that we have in the way of social media and social networking and other online tools to not have this class be some static thing where we just sit in our own homes and or libraries wherever we're doing our work but that we can bridge gaps between us for the class and really connect via these various tools for instance i will be doing podcasting like i'm doing right now to introduce the class and do some other things. And so I'm going to try to make it interesting and I'll have a little treasure hunts. Uh, like for instance, right now I'm up in, up in the mountains and maybe we'll go on some other adventures. But the idea is to bridge gaps, not only just for technology, but also bringing community together via technology. So it, it, all, all kinds of things I want to try to do with this. So what I ask you to do first, when you log on and see this video, hi, um, I want you to do the introduction uh, assignment, which is on Blackboard introduce yourself, the SIA assignment. So please log on and go to the uh, discussion board and fill that out to explain a little bit about yourself, introduce yourself. I also would like you to share with me what you think of our current gaps for your district, your experience with technology, and you know, what limitations have you seen? The haves and have-nots, the digital divide, if you haven't heard that term, about the students who have access to technology and those who do not. Uh, facts show us that those students who have access to technology will make twice as much money in their careers as those who do not. Also, those who do not have technology are at a disadvantage and have a hard time getting access to it. So it's it's kind of a perpetuation that hasn't you know, c continues on, and we want to break that that process and get kids access to material in some way. So I want you to share what you've noticed, what you identify as some of the gaps that you see in, in technology and uh, technology education. So identify that in your introduction. So introduce yourself, you can share some of those resources and based on what you share, I'm going to be posting other information as best I can custom tailored to our community, our group, uh, you who are taking this class. Uh, one other thing for the introduction, the course is going to be made up of uh, your participation with the online resources. I'm going to be using some other, like I said, online tools, social media, and if you haven't had experience with that, that's fine. I'm going to be doing something called screencasting to show you how it works. I'll be posting that. It's basically videos of my computer screen, and I'll take you step by step through how those tools work. I'm also going to be using Google Sites. If you haven't used that before, no problem. I'll show you how that works. Those of you who have already used Google Sites, either with me or on your own, uh, be very similar to what we've done in the past. We we'll would use that to help build community. So our online resources that we're going to use for sure is Blackboard and I just ask you to log in on a regular basis. I will be prodding you in a nice way via email and other resources to prompt you on to other challenges. The other components of the class to share out besides your participation online is a reflective journal. So as I have you go on adventures or explore things, I want you to keep track of what you've learned, uh, what you've explored, resources you found, and again, I'll give you examples of that and where to post that and uh, make sure that's really clear for you. We're going to be building a research paper. And the idea behind this is that as you find really powerful tools, resources, or examples that you see of people bridging gaps, uh, we want to share that. And I want to explore that. And I want to document it in a way that if we were to read each other's papers, that we'd be really inspired, see the resources we found, the, the, your arguments that you're making to support the use of these various tools with the research that you found to back up your statements. I got all kinds of traffic going on here. Here, let's take a look. So you've got cars going down the road. This is kind of fun, isn't it? I hope you're enjoying this. This is kind of interesting for me. Um, 
I'm also going to have other assignments that will be a part of the makeup of the course, and I'll, I'll announce those to you. And I will be posting information very clearly, both on Blackboard and on the Google site, once we are using that uh, more detail. All right, so last thing I'd say is, you'll notice that the syllabus is attached in Blackboard. If you log into Blackboard, you can look at the discussion board, do the SIA assignment. Also take a look at the syllabus, you'll see the Word file that you can download. Um, it gives you a, an overview of the material, but not the specifics. I will be posting the specifics for you. And I'm going to be using a lot of video like this because, personally, it's so stale to just read stuff. Um, it's nice to actually have a face to it or an explanation. And I might elicit your, your participation via tools like this um, if that seems to fit for you. The idea is building community via online resources, using social media. We're going to try to model that as best we can with this class and make it interesting. And my hope is that you really enjoy participating in this class and that you're kind of excited to get email from me and don't fear it. So it's not a, a, a task you loathe, but more kind of like you're curious what I'm up to and what I'm going to be asking you to do. So I'm going to sign out from right next to I-90. And uh, it's kind of fun hanging out here. I'm going to try not to get run over on the road. Um, remember, podcast safely. Don't stand in the middle of the road when you're podcasting. That would be bad. Have fun, and I will be in touch with you. And have a great night, or day, I guess, depending on what it is.